Hello everyone. Our today's topic is fun with magnets. We will be learning about what are magnets and how they work and we will also do some fun experiments with magnet. What is magnet? Magnet is a rock or a fragment of metal which has the ability to pull some specific types of metals towards itself. The force with which a magnet attracts other objects towards itself is called magnetism. Let's take a look at a bar of magnet. The end parts of a magnet are known as poles. Usually, one is marked as N, meaning north, and the other is marked as S, meaning south. The same sides of magnets repel each other. For example, if we have two magnet bars and we make the end parts of both bars face each other closely, they will push each other away. The same will happen if both S parts were brought together. However, the opposite poles attract each other. For instance, if we brought S pole of one magnet close to the end pole of the other magnet, they will attract and instantly stick to each other. Magnetic and non-magnetic materials The objects which get attracted to magnet are known as magnetic materials, such as those items made with iron, cobalt and nickel, whereas those objects which do not get attracted to magnet are called non-magnetic materials, such as those items made with wood, plastic, soil, glass, rubber and fabric. Let's do a fun experiment with magnet. Let's take a bar of magnet and put some different items on a table such as a nail, a pencil, an eraser, a paper clip, a tissue paper, a sock, a hairpin, a steel ring and a glass jar. Out of these subjects, which one do you think would be attracted to the magnet? Let's find out. Let's bring the magnet close to each object one by one and note which ones are pulled towards it and which ones are not. The nail quickly got pulled up by the magnet but the pencil did not nor did the eraser. Wow! The paper clip stuck to the magnet too but the tissue paper and the sock did not. See, the magnet pulled up the hairpin and the steel ring. Oh, the glass jar did not stick to the magnet. So, from the experiment, we found that the nail, paper, clip, hairpin and steel ring are attracted towards magnet and that is because they are made of iron and steel, which are magnetic materials. 
and the pencil, tissue paper, eraser, sock and glass jar did not get pulled towards the magnet because they are made from wood, rubber, fabric and glass which are non-magnetic materials. You may have noticed from the experiment that the magnetic materials did get pulled up from the table towards the magnet but they did so only when the magnet was brought close to them. The magnet did not attract them when it was far from them. Do you know why that is? It is because of magnetic field. What is magnetic field? When a magnetic material gets closer and closer to the magnet, the power of the magnet on the object as we call magnetism becomes stronger and stronger. Similarly, as the object goes farther and farther away from a magnet, the pull or magnetism of the magnet on the object becomes weaker and weaker and disappears at one point. The area of that invisible force or magnetism that is the area around the magnet where the pull exists is called magnetic field. Whatever magnetic material is placed inside the magnetic field, it will be attracted towards the magnet. Do you know? There are many things around us which use magnet. For instance, purses and some jewelry often have magnetic clasps to close them. Compass, television, refrigerator door, cabinet doors, motors and generators, doorbell, computer, microwave oven, toaster and trains have magnets inside them too. We hope now you have learned about magnets. If some concepts are not clear, then replay the video again and again. Still, if you have some questions, then ask your teacher.